My name is Dua Gawish. I'm the founder of The Hair Addict, and it's a company that encourages all women to love themselves enough to leave their hair natural. And actually, we expanded our vision to include kids and males as well. So you see, all women growing up in the Middle East, they think that their textured hair is not good enough, is not worthy of being left as is and taking care of it the way it is. And actually what we do is that we make those women know, we make those guys know, and we make the kids know that their natural hair is beautiful and it's worthy of all the care and the love in the world. And so what we do is that we provide the community that gives tips and encourages them to do so. We provide the products and we also provide the tools for them to enjoy and to love their natural hair. When we scaled up our operation in Egypt, the entire country had a problem with importation. And actually most of our pack mat and raw materials were imported at the time. And actually some of the hair care tools that we introduced to the market for the first time were imported as well. But actually, thankfully, we overcame this and we managed to localize most of them. Very big rewarding part of my job is that when I go to any place, to my kids' schools, to any shop, and I find people recognizing me and telling me, actually, your group touched our lives, it changed us, it built our character, we stood up for ourselves, defending our natural hair. And actually, the most complimenting thing I hear is that when people come up to me and they tell me, you know what, my kid had no self-confidence in her natural hair, and now she loves it and she brags about it. I like the diversity. I like how cosmopolitan it is. So for example, if you, have, uh, if you want to be conservative, you can. If you want to be liberal, you can. If you want uh, your kids to go dancing, uh, they can. If you want your kids to learn how to read the Quran, you can find people helping you with that if you are a Muslim. If you, uh, or if you want to seek any religious education for your kids, you can. If, so you have everything for everyone. Actually, this answer is quite funny. So actually, I would sit at home with my kids and watch Harry Potter movies back to back. We're, we're Potterheads and actually we watched all the fan theories and we're, we're nuts about Harry Potter. 